Donnie Harrison would get out of Saverta Park High and have Mark Bird Burdett drive him up Ritchie Highway to Ann's Dairy Cream for a milkshake and a foot long. That was a long, long time ago, and Ann's is still sending home people with a full tummy and a smile. Now, WMER2 News is all grown up. Don Harrison stopped in today for what's become a great tradition for many folks. Driving past Marley Station Mall on Ritchie Highway, you'll see Ann's Dairy Cream. When you come in, you know exactly what you're going to get. Footlongs, milkshakes, a little bit of harassment. Are you ready? <laughs> well, people have been putting up with that harassment and those hot dogs and shakes for 71 years now. They are not just your average hot dog. It's a footlong hot dog that we deep fry and we put mustard, onions, and chili on it. In seven decades, Ann's has been through a lot. In the mid 80s, as Glen Burnie was expanding, the Marley Station Mall wanted to build on Ann's Dairy Cream property. They refused to move, so they built the mall around Glen Burnie's favorite hot dog joint. Cheeseburger just catch up by itself. The staff has had to endure a lot over the decades, but nothing as devastating as this year when the news of the original owners came. Uh, Howard Pinsky and his wife Thea um, both passed away in January from COVID. As devastating as that was, they knew they had to continue because of the customers. Did I mention these aren't your average hot dogs? No, no, no. nothing compares. It's unique. It's got a character. This place is fantastic. We even had a 50 year anniversary pin that they gave out for 50 years. It's a hot dog. Mike and Sharon Talbot have been eating meals here sometimes five days a week for decades. Thank you. Oh, wow. Now she has a 70 year pin to go along with her 50 year pin. Being in the same place for seven decades is quite a feat, but it might take me that long to work off all these calories. You know, you don't want that if you're on diet. <laughs> uh, we don't even know how many calories are in one. Your caloric intake doesn't seem to be at the top of the list for the concerns of the customers that have shared this experience for generations. Dad brought me here. He's been coming here since he was a kid in the 60s. And then he brought me here when I was a kid in the 80s. And now I'm bringing my daughters here now, currently. You only have one chance at your first bite of an aunt's hot dog. <laughs> if Devlin wants to bring her kids here in 71 years, I've been told that's a possibility. Ann's is going to be here. We may not be, but somebody else will be here taking care of it. In Glen Burnie, Don Harrison, WMAR2 News.